Harry accepts becoming a U.S. citizen, which would mean giving up his royal title. Last night, royal experts asked Harry, 39, to speak out after being deeply hurt when ordered to leave Frogmore Cottage. An updated House of Commons reports tabled this week, the Duke of Sussex announced the United States as his new country of residence. Hello, welcome to the Royal Daily Times. Before we continue, please subscribe to the channel for more British royal family news. He and Meghan, 42, moved to California in 2020 after deciding to leave the UK and step down as working members of the royal family. However, in business documents submitted to the environmentally friendly company Travelist, Harry said he had lived in the US since June 29th last year. On that day, his father, King Charles, with the support of Harry's brother, William, ordered him to return the keys to his Windsor hideout. Royal writer Phil Dampier said it was a sign that Harry, who has made several attacks on the royal family, was cutting ties with Britain. Last night he said, as always with Harry, you can read a lot into his actions. Being kicked out of Frogmore Cottage hurt him deeply. Charles and William knew something needed to be done to emphasize that Harry and Meghan were outside the firm, but perhaps he still thought he could maintain a base here. He has now demonstrated that he accepts that he will live his entire life in the United States. Harry said he is considering becoming a U.S. citizen this year, which would mean he would have to give up his royal title. Dampier believes he may never live in England again and added that he will miss him. He added that the British public has lost respect for him and sees him as the prince of laziness and discord. Harry founded Travelist in 2019 and was previously listed as a UK resident. He is expected to return next month to celebrate the 10th anniversary of the Invictus Games. Last week, the US government took his previous visa application to court, accusing him of lying about it. Last year, Harry admitted to using drugs and this should be reported. U.S. presidential candidate Donald Trump warned, if he lies, they will have to act.